Hello there. In this video I'm going to assemble our new rear four link bracket that you can assemble yourself. You can weld up yourself in your garage. Uh, this is comprised of this flat plate which has these laser cut slits here that you can bend by hand and uh, we supply this three hole block that you weld on for supporting the coilover bolts. And this is designed for a three inch axle housing. It's easy to modify that if you've got a three and a quarter inch housing. Um, so I've already started one here and what I've done is just welded the block to the plate and bent one side already. You can see the laser cut slit here, how after you bend it, it forms a nice corner to corner weld or corner to corner joint there that's really easy to fill with MIG weld and, and grind it flush and you still got a lot of weld in there. So I'm going to clamp this to my bench and weld the other, sorry, I'm just going to bend the other side. And using an adjustable wrench, I can grab that and fold it up here until it's straight. I don't have my square out, but let me go grab it. Now you can check square on this by, by holding it up to your bench. As you can see, it's pretty easy to weld and it holds the, it holds the angle too. Come back a bit. Okay, so we've got that square. Next thing we want to do is make sure that our urethane bushing sits in there and it will and after you weld it you'll be able to uh, pinch that with the bolt that's going to going to draw that in and cinch it against the uh, the inner sleeve and the other thing that's good to do is check straightness so that you can get a bolt in there and make sure the holes line up and before you weld this block on the plate what I have done is cut off the threaded part of some 5 8 bolts and what that does is let the bolt sit in the plate like that but it doesn't it means I can still lay this on the bench I don't have to have it hanging over the bench for my bolt to clear so you just put those in there make sure your holes are lined up and uh, just throw some weld on there it doesn't have to be really solid because it's not holding any weight it's just a just a reinforcing block Anyway, now you can go ahead and weld, weld those um, joints up and weld it to your axle housing. You got a nice four bar bracket. You can check them out on our website, welderseries.com. Thank you.